Now, Jay, when did you first encounter the book, The 12 Universal Laws of the State? Uh, <laughs> you were there before the book was even written. Exactly. You, what was your first experience with the book? I, I thought it was, it, it, not, I didn't think, it was definitely a godsend, uh, 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 Doc. Because one thing I knew about you, see, I knew who, who had wrote the, wrote the book. And I remember going to church, and you know what I'm getting ready to talk about. I'm talking mm -hmm. about at Reverend Ike. Yes. And so you were in tune. And you when you start talking about the 12 universal laws of success, my mind immediately went to the 12 disciples. Yes. Not knowing what I know, but I just said, what well, this man, I mean, this it, it was at another level. Yes. So Doc, when you said you were coming out with that, with, with that book, I said, I know I need to get a copy. Mm -hmm. So yes, that's that's how that all came into mm -hmm. being. I was ready for it. Yes. Now, was there any one part of the book that stood out to you? Yes, and uh -huh. I just said it earlier, Doc. Uh -huh. I, I just said it earlier. The fact that if you consider yourself to be a winner in life, uh -huh. you're going to have all kinds of challenges, okay? Yes. And you're going to be tested. Yes. If, no matter what you say you, you're about, you are going to be tested. Mm. So I just said earlier that what I realized from that book is that you, Doc, is a man of persistence, mm. vision, mm -hmm. insight. Okay, and I said to myself, I have to uh, understand this. So, my, so what I'm saying very simply is this: I realized that in order for me to win in life, I'm going to be challenged. Uh -huh. So, what I got from it, my first takeaway on that was that Jay, don't ever quit, no matter what. No matter what. Wow.